What's going on guys, it's your boy Crowlander here for another Clash of Clans video. Basically this is just talking about the next summer update and how it's going to cost zero anything to um, like do your troops. It's going to be ridiculous so you don't have to pay gold or elixir or even dark elixir so it's incredible. So basically we just found out that um, in the next update they're... Um, They've removed all gold, elixir and dark elixir training costs for troops, spells and siege machines. So it's, it's going to be insane. You can literally just battle as much as you want without having to save up elixir. So I don't know about you, if you um, want to do like loads of attacks like I do, um, you, sh you run out pretty fast if you start upgrading stuff and then you just are all like waiting for stuff. So it's just ridiculous. So yeah, not having the cost to be able to... Um, like pay for us is awesome so yeah basically that's in the next update um, so if we dive into the zero cost training uh, and uh, they want players to try new strategies and tactics without the worry of spending resources when you are unsure if that strategy or army build will even work so basically they want you to experiment with new troops new combinations without having to worry about the cost so they're removing it for the summer update um, they're allowing players to experiment with new tactics. Removing all training costs will grant you greater freedom to try out those zany ideas you've been concocting. So yeah, so basically army training time and housing space requirements are still present. So they'll still uh, stay the same guys. Um, the training boost perk from the season challenges will now only affect training time. Uh, players will no longer receive returned resources when donating to a clan mate. Um, donation refunds from clan perks have been removed uh, events will no longer discount training for troops or spells elixir loot in legend league has been reduced to match gold loot so yeah basically just having the free <laughs> like the free troop um like cooking time is ridiculous just to just be able to cook to it. shut up alexa <laughs> Um, yeah, so there's elixir cost changes. So um, a level one elixir cost would be 10k, and a level seven elixir cost would be 8 million. So the, due to the increase in, in available elixir from the removal of training costs, we've made some changes that will primarily affect lower town hall levels. So starting at town hall level five, walls will be able to be upgraded with either gold or elixir where it was just originally gold. Um, it's only to get a certain level where you can use gold and elixir. Uh, the clan castle now requires elixir to upgrade at all levels. Um, the amount of elixir required is the same as the former gold cost. So I'm guessing they're keeping the cooking of troops free like forever now. So that's why they're making changes to like um, building upgrades and stuff like that. Um, they're removing all function from army training remove all function from our, no longer will you need to remove units from your army one at a time before clearing your entire army with a te tedious process ah oh, so if you make like 230 archers you can just remove them all rather than doing one at a time that's pretty cool um oh, there's also a new scenery randomizer so if you if you just want to randomly choose a scenery and you've got all of them like i have you can just click on a randomizer and just choose one at random which is pretty quirky uh, so there you have it guys. If you haven't already, please like this video and don't forget to subscribe. We're so close to 10,300 now. I'm trying to get to 11,000 before the end of the year. So we've got like half a year to go. So that is possible. <laughs> I haven't set myself too high. Now I've got my computer back up and running again. Um, also, I'm on TikTok. So go check that out. And Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. All the links are in the description below. Thanks for watching guys.